what do you think has been driving uh, a lot of the hash rate over the last, uh, honestly, like six months, uh, even though we, we saw that kind of second decline? I mean, still, it's it, it's been absolutely ripping the last few weeks and still is generally like, you know, been trending upwards for the last like six to eight months. It's just kind of baffled me because, you know, even though, again, energy prices, as we talked about earlier, like are down from like the middle of 2022, they're still higher than the beginning of 2022. Um and then on top of that, you, you know, even though Bitcoin is down like 67 percent instead of 76 percent right now, it's still down 70 or 67 percent. Um, so, you know, you, you have the two main components of being a successful Bitcoin miner that are like pretty strongly against, you know, someone someone favorably stepping back in and, and mining. And then obviously the, the third one being the fact that hash rate is at all time highs. So like the competition to mine is at all time highs in addition to those other two factors. Do you think it's just been um, like some very like large energy producers that are kind of dipping their toes in the water? That's been kind of my thesis. I don't know. Um, but, you know, if, if we go back to like mid-2022, uh, I think it was, it was Exxon announced that they had launched like a pilot program with, uh, I forget the, the entity that they were working with, but, you know, they basically were kind of like experimenting with Bitcoin mining and, and you know, flared gas. What do you what do you think has been, or is it just the fact that like a lot of these rigs were financed on debt, and so um, they've been like quote unquote inorganically like plugged into what we're used to in other Bitcoin cycles? Yeah, no, it's a it's an interesting question. I feel like a lot of people have been confused by it, certainly. And yeah, like you know, Exxon is one of the energy companies that's dipping their toe in the Bitcoin mining industry. Conoco Phillips, Shell sponsoring the Bitcoin conference. So yeah, the energy industry is definitely like move inching, inching closer and closer to the Bitcoin mining industry. By no means would I say like they're you know 100% all in on Bitcoin mining. Obviously, it's definitely not true. There's a long ways to go, but they are inching closer. I wouldn't necessarily say that's like the main reason hash rate is going up. I think a lot of it is probably just because yes, so many things have gone wrong in the mining industry. I mean, like you said, difficulty has gone up. Energy prices are high. Uh, Bitcoin prices down. So it's like the trifecta of every possible thing that could go wrong. <laughs> but with that said, you know, it's still profitable to mine Bitcoin, right? Like if you have, you know, commercial your energy costs are zero, who gives a shit? <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. If your energy costs are zero, you can mine Bitcoin at zero dollars. So that's pretty good. Right. Um, and then also you got to consider like, okay, summer of 2021, we saw Bitmain released their XP, which is like the flagship, most efficient machine. It runs like 140 tera hash. So if people are simply like unplugging, you know, S17s and S9s that are just not profitable at like almost any electricity rate, and they're plugging in the new XP, I mean, that's like a, you know, a multiple jump in hash rate just right there. So I think yeah, it's, just, it's funny you yeah. said that like Checkmate replied to, um, I posted like a chart of, of hash rate like two days ago and like the 30 day change in it. And he replied, I didn't even know Glassnode had this, but like a breakdown of like the makeup of hash rate by machines. And it was like, his point was basically the fact that like, it was mostly newer gen machines that have been doing the plugging in over the last six months. And therefore, even though hash rate is at an all, all time high, the amount of power that's being expended to achieve that level of hash rate isn't at all time high. So like the efficiency of, of miners is technically like an all time high for the sake of that point. Yeah, exactly, exactly. Um, that was a great point. Yeah, I mean, the people are literally, like, the as the hardware becomes more efficient, you can use less energy, produce more hashes, and that's going to make hash rate go up. It doesn't necessarily mean, like, the mining industry is exploding, over, especially over the past year. Obviously, it hasn't. Of course, if Bitcoin runs up a bunch, then the mining industry will be exploding yet again. Um, but, yeah, I think that's well said. Great points.